Hello everyone and welcome to Soda Swirl here on Food Review UK and another instalment of Drink Tank. Now, what is Drink Tank? Drink Tank is the show where myself and other UK food reviewers get together and all review the same product. So this time we are merging Fanta Orange Original with Coca-Cola. This is called Classic but it's, it's just normal Coke. This time I'm reviewing it with Reese from Totally Official Reviews. JWW Wrestling, and I believe Food for You UK is also getting involved in this one. So make sure that you get involved in all of their channels. Uh, the links to them will be in the description below. So we're going to go 50 50 ratio on this. And interestingly, I should say that I recently went to Germany for my stag do marriage. As I'm filming this, I get married in uh, six days. Oh, absolutely terrifying. No, fine. Anyway, in Germany, they had a product called Mezzo. Now, Mezzo was basically a um, kind of orange Coke, and it was surprisingly really nice. Uh, so I'm expecting the mixture of these to be pretty good. Right, so here we go, half Coke. About there, I'm going to say. that look about right, guys? And the other half, Fanta. Right, so here we go. I think that's about right, isn't it? Now, Charlie Fleming uh, usually does drink tank with us, however, he said that he's not going to do this one because he pretty much uh, did one before when it created, well, he had a, a problem with a syrup or soda machine, I think, and it spat out a really dodgy coloured Coke. Um, yeah, pretty reasonable. I think this does, it's a little bit lighter than it is on the camera, actually, um, a little bit lighter in real life, but it does look like a pretty ropey Coke. Um, in terms of smell... Yeah, it smells quite nice, actually. I mean, it does smell like mezzo. Certainly Coke and Orange coming through. They're both crisp, sweet and refreshing products. So I'm expecting this to taste pretty good, even if it doesn't look too appetising. But does Coke really look that appetising? Could you imagine if we lived in a world where Coke was clear and we, we peered into this universe where Coke is brown? They'd probably be like, what on earth are they doing drinking that weird brown thing? I suppose it's the same with tea and coffee before you add milk. But then we had milk in it. That's basically cow excretion. That's weird. We're weird. We are weird. Right, let's try it guys. Tits up, bottoms in. Mmm. Wow. Wow. Um, freshly opened bottles, so they're very, very powerful with, with carbonation. Yeah, super, super frothy uh, and sharp with carbonation. Can anyone tell me why we carbonate things? I'd be interested to hear how how or why that came about. Flavour's really good though. Um, I'm not actually a massive fan of Coke, especially out of a bottle. And I'm not really a massive fan of Fanta. I will occasionally get a Fanta in places like... Like fast food joints, I'll get it one in 20 visits. I'll usually get a water or, or something like that, um, as I try not to drink soda. Um, but don't really drink them out of the bottle or can like that. But this for me... This is far nicer than either. It's too fizzy, but that's, you know, fine, I suppose. Very sweet, and I'd say that you get a pretty even uh, amount of flavour from both of them. The orange comes through, it's kind of kind of in the front, uh, but then you've got this kind of just weird whatever the hell flavour Coke is in the background um, that just kind of takes away a little bit of the tang of the orange and a little bit of the uh, kind of tartness that you get in your mouth. When you have Fanta, you get like an almost like claggy, that kind of, I don't know how to express that feeling in words, or that taste in words, or the meh in words. Yeah. But the Coke slightly mellows it out. It is a little bit weird, but I think in the right setting, if you're out and about with your friends, um, I think that would be quite a refreshing drink with maybe in a bottle with some ice, or maybe like you did at school where you put your bottle in the freezer and it froze, and then you had it throughout the day as it cooled down. I didn't really do that. Uh, so, but this is quite nice. I give it a pretty, pretty solid three stars. It's not going to be winning any awards anytime soon, but uh, there we go. As I say, guys, this was an episode of Drink Tank, so please do do me a favour and support the other UK food review creators who are uh, bringing content to you 
very often and putting a lot of hard work and effort in so do go and check them out uh, you know people like JWW they've been going for years years and years guys uh, so please go and reward their hard work by subscribing and you'll enjoy their content as well so win win everyone's a winner baby that's what I blew thanks very much for watching what would you like to see the UK food review people review next time on drink tank please let us know in the comments section which is currently located below but in the future who knows maybe it'll be above and subscribe for more videos <laughs> we, we just asked Gordon standard Gordon. no well when I explained <laughs> why is the stalk on why is there a stalk there in Storks the first place stalks make gin <laughs> No, you'll get them confused with babies. Oh, babies make you. <laughs>